Well, good day, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of the Albino Rhino Non-Alcoholic Review. Today, you have the Rhino, and we're looking at a beer from the... Well, a beer, a pop from the UK. This is Bar Cola. Boo! So, we have Aiden here with us. This, this is a low-sugar, full flavor, is what it says. Uh, so, this is from Glasgow, so I originally thought that it would have been from England. I knew it was the UK, I just figured England. But no, it's a Scottish pop. Are you talking about me? No. <laughs> Not everything's about you, honey. What is that? Okay. Not everything's about you. <laughs> um, I beg to differ. And uh, I'm going to assume that it's like a cheaper variant in the UK because it's 49 pence. Uh, I don't know how 49 pence compares with us. I haven't done the... It actually tastes like a Coke. I haven't done the a conversion Coke. in a long time. It tastes like a Coke. It smells like, it it's smells like RC that's Cola. That's big in Scotland, isn't it? Oh, yeah, try it's that. from Scotland. It's from yeah, Glasgow. try that. I haven't tried it yet. It tastes like pop, right? It tastes like RC Cola. It smells like RC Cola. It tastes like Coke to me. No. Actually, even, even less than RC Cola... This tastes kind of like Cot. I don't know what that is. Cot was a uh, giant tiger brand. It was like 49 cents for a two liter when we were kids. Was that a lot when you were a kid? But yeah, it's not, it doesn't taste as sugary. No. Which is nice. This is a oh, honey, the plastic <laughs> bottles make you fat. This is, this is a multi-pack can, not for sale as a single unit. I bought it as a single unit, just... Yes, but that's in Europe. Yes. But look, look at how they did it too, to screw with people. They got rid of the UPC. There's no UPC on this. Yeah, they probably just put it in, like, yep. into their system or whatever. Um, My side's over here. Out of ten, buddy? Eight, because it tastes like Coke to me. Out of ten, honey? Mm -hmm. If it tasted like Dr. Pepper... pepper It'll be a 10 if it tastes like Dr. Pepper. I'd probably give it a 5. There's nothing wrong with it. It reminds me of my childhood, which is the worst part about it. But, uh, yeah. Bye, guys.